to change if you are not able to change the slide yeah okay please continue yeah we can yeah uh, my name is indra sagaram uh, i am doing tech in business from last uh, uh, 12 years to 12 to 13 years i was started in 2011 till we are going we are doing operation in tamil nadu and karnataka the gherkin crop is a very good remuneration for the farmers we are doing this crop only this crop for the last 20 years more than 20 years in this area <clears throat> karnataka and tamil nadu are doing uh, We bought our company. Our company is a 30-year-old company, started in 2011, located in Genji, Vilupuram district, Tamil Nadu. Kerkin contract farming and agriculture services we are doing. Produce Kerkin through contract farming and selling to the reputed uh, export companies we are doing. Best service giving for farmers companies to improve their socio-economic status. Lot of farmers they are getting more money in this crop. Create a goodwill and the reputation in each farmer and export companies. Providing direct and indirect employment opportunity to more than ten thousand people in the rural areas, like in Tamil Nadu, Karnataka. This is our company introduction. Now, about Gherkin, Gherkin is a botanical name, Sukumi Sativus. Duration is ninety days crop. This one, yield starts from thirty-five days. Harvesting will be in fifty to sixty days. Suitable soil will be red soil, sandy soil, red sandy soil. And twentieth day, we have to do the staking, staking uh, because uh, soil will damage the crop. Uh, because of that reason, we are st staking the crop uh, before twenty days or after before harvesting. Irrigation will be done on th three days once, and spacing will be row to row four feet, and uh, plant to plant will be one feet. But this is usually pickled when four to eight cm in length and pickled in jars and can with vinegar. And Brian, as today emerged as the origin of the finest gherkin cultivation processing and exporters to the ever-growing world environment, India is a major exporter for gherkin. Gherkin is growing in contract farming, small and marginal farmers. Currently, there are more than ninety thousand small and marginal farmers who are engaged in in the production of gherkins. Initially, processed gherkins were exported in bulk packing. Now we are exporting in the ready-to-eat jar also. um most of the co companies they, they are doing jars now exported uh, through jars only the normally the pest disease will be gherkin crop is very severe um thrips red mites leaf miner white fly fruit borer will be there in the uh, crop we have to control on this and major disease will be damping of downy mildew stem blight Uh, about a million LMS virus. Virus. Kerkin is used in this. Kerkin is used for pickle. Hundred percent export from India. Uh, it is used for only for pickle. Then there is no other uh, usage. Exporting more than twenty countries across the world by Indian companies. Uh, mainly USA, Europe, Russia, Spain, Mexico, Canada, Belgium, Turkey, France, Germany, Netherlands. We are exporting. Uh, the yield will be minimum 10 to 12 tons per acre, and the average price will be uh, farmers getting 12, 25 to 30 per kg. And the price will be on uh, based on the size of the uh, fruit. The smaller size fruits will getting more price, and the bigger size fruit is getting uh, lesser price. Uh, in this uh, condition, the uh, labor requirement is more. So based on the farmer harvesting, the price is uh, we are fixing before uh, going to sowing. We are fix the price. The only crop is getting a fixed price before sowing. Uh, we are taking as a four grade now. First grade is forty five rupees, and second grade will be twenty five, and third grade will be thirteen rupees, and last grade will be thirty three rupees. In each of the first grade will be around thirty to forty percent will come. Uh, second grade ten to fifteen percent will come. Uh, fourth, uh, third grade will be thirty to thirty five percent. Last will be five to ten percent will come. Totally uh, in this crop. We are given inputs around fifty to sixty thousand to the farmers. The farmers getting inputs from our side without any interest getting. After that, we are given inputs. We are deriving from farmer agar grains. The farmer mainly 
depending on this crop for some particular areas uh, like hill areas and small marginal farmers uh, mainly help this for uh, this crop to improve their life approximately 1 to 1.5 lakhs per acre uh, income they are getting for in, in one one crop cycle uh, in india almost the 3000 35000 acre will be sold and farmers get more than 5 lakh farmers are getting benefited for this crop total crop products approach more than 2 lakh 50000 metric ton we are sending to uh, export in the total top uh, turnover approximately last year 23 24 it is around uh, 2500 crore number of companies in india more than 40 companies are there in india growing since karnataka tamil nadu andhra only three states they are growing this crop provide all in uh, we are our company approve our approach will be we are providing all inputs uh, seeds fertilizer pesticide gvs jute everything to the farmer recover from crop value without interest Goods are delivered to the farmer's field at the free of transportation charge. Cash advance to the farmer for field operation and labor wages. Export be, experts visit the field to provide technical advices to each farmer's weekly twice till crop end. Every week we are, we are going to visit the farmer field and we recommend what are the chemicals they, they, uh, they want to spray, what are the pesticides they want to spray. Uh, we are putting in practice also. Each and every aspect of um, crop we are doing. Uh, teaching them to grow if the farmers don't want to know about grain before itself weighing and procuring for farmer field which reduce transportation charge we are we are not charging any transportation cost cost from farmer field we are collecting farmer field in front of the farmer we are weighing and what are the payment is there based on that we can make payment the payment will be made on 15 days once uh, once crop done we are done the final settlement payment through bank, bank account only we are doing all crop buy back guarantee which we which avoid waste of farmer we are buy all the crop from farmers whatever uh, farmers uh, they are um, growing and getting that we are taken all the crop get kin crop mainly benefits to the farmers because of it's a short duration crop Uh, in less water consumption the uh, compared to other crop fixed price we are we are fixed the price before sowing because uh, there is no deviation from uh, any any time any point of time once you fix the price the, the, the price is fixed guaranteed minimum income when the farmer get more income uh, based on the their how, how much they are getting crop less investment the farmer investing only for uh, There are minimum amount of thirty five to thirty thousand labor labor wages only, but the remaining all part of in inputs and everything we are only investing. No weight loss will transport you. If in other crop they are transporting uh, uh, to the market in the meantime they will get many may, minimum weight loss will be there. But in our case we are we are taking all weighting from farmer field. Na? That's why we are not getting any weight loss. Save transporting charges minimum three three to five rupees per kg. And transport charges also they are not charging. Immediate and secure payment. Technical support we are providing uh, each and every farmer with uh, with uh, agri graduate. Uh, save progress commission minimum ten percent. If normal crop we are they are going to sell in the market and they have to pay minimum ten percent of um, commission. But in our case we are not any taken any commission from farmers. We are taking taking all material without commission. And we are paying a water or the fixed price. We are paying. Why by guarantee? Uh, guarantee we are at the time of sowing. We are given agreement to the farm mutual and understanding and the agreement to the farmers. And based on the agreement, we will buy all the crops without any failure. Interest free input loan. We are paying almost fifty to sixty thousand rupees to the farmers, but we are not charging any interest to the farmers. We are getting only crop uh, and the water. The market price only we are getting. Only thing from the farmers. Happy to the farmers without worry. Some of the photos I am showing here, the crop photos, the farmer photos. Thank you. If you have any question, you can ask me. Okay. Um, 
Thank you, Mr. Inba, for the presentation. Now I'll quickly take up some questions. And uh, yes, sir. yeah, one second. Okay. What are the key benefits of Gherkin contract farming for a small scale farmers? For small scale farmers. Hello. Hello. What are the key benefits of Gherkin contract contract farming uh, Gherkin farming for small scale farmers? Normally, when the small scale farmers they don't know which crop they are going to uh, going to grow and they don't know how to grow. Uh, they don't know uh, price and all, how 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 much they are getting and all. But in in our case, in, the, in the, we are fixing the price in the before itself. Before itself. Uh, we are ensuring the yield also. Uh, minimum of 10 to 12 tons of per acre we are getting in and we are getting more we are giving more uh, support to the farmer they don't want to know before the uh, before uh, sowing we, each and every uh, point of view we, we, we are uh, educating them and we are getting the graph from them and uh, the farmer don't want to go anywhere they they only they have to do the cultural practices only Remaining all, we are taking care of. Okay. Next question is, how does contract farming mitigate market risk for Gherkin producers? Contract farming, we are fixing the price. Now, because of that reason, we are, we are getting confirmation price from buyers. Um, after that, only we are uh, fixing the price. The price is fixed by uh, on. Gherkin Association is there, Gherkin Growers Association. They are, they are fixing the price based on the market uh, demand and supply. Uh, in that, every year we are increasing 10 to 12% of the uh, minimum price. Because of that reason, farmers are interested to grow this Gherkin. It, it, it will be more helpful than the market supply. Sometimes in the market, they are getting a lower price. Sometimes they don't want to harvest also. But in our case, they are getting minimum guaranteed amount they are getting. That's why their farmers are getting more benefit. Hello. Ma'am? Yeah, one second. One second. I'll... Uh... Yes. Okay, next question is, what are the typical contract terms in Gherkin farming agreements? There is mutual agreement only is there. Uh, normally, in the in case of crop failure is there, mean, uh, the farmer don't want to take any risk. The company will take care of everything. Uh, whatever material we are given, we will not get back uh, from farmer. Uh, we will take care of this all the material. Uh, and the other things, Nothing, there is no conflicts in that. Other than this, company has to bear all the losses. If any farmers getting any losses, any climatic anything. Ma'am? Yeah. Next question is. How do companies ensure quality control in contract gherkin farming? Hello? Can you hear me? Hello? Yeah, tell Hello? me. Yeah, ma'am. Hello. Can you hear me? Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Okay. Okay. So I was asking. Uh, one second. How do companies ensure quality control in con contract gherkin farming? Yeah, ma'am. Uh, we we are uh, an agriculturist uh, staff. We have, ma'am. Each and every farmer's field we are visiting. We once in a week, uh, twice a week. Uh, and we get the assurance to the quality. Uh, the farmers also, they are aware about this is a used for pickle. 
because of that reason they are also uh, more concentration on quality and this product so you do that cut the okay. model in half with this and now you can and uh, what are the main challenges the farmers face when engaging in gherkin contract farming now you have a mini the main now nowadays the main challenge is for uh, labor uh, this is a labor oriented of one acre if you are growing for one acre they have to a minimum engage 8 to 10 uh, labor the labor cost is more 300 to 400 rupees per uh, per head because of that reason the labor availability also very less because of uh, government schemes is there under this program is there lot of schemes are there they are going for there and uh, they are getting more money uh, compared to this labor about that they, they are ready not ready to go for agricultural uh, work also because of that reason the farmers are very afraid to grow this one the main challenge will be this one and the second thing is climate sometimes the heavy rain will be there sometimes uh heavy summer uh, will be there sometime uh, this one the winter is there means most of this disease will come this is the two challenges will be there now uh, other than this other than that uh, farmers are very happy okay uh, next question is what role do agronomists play in the success of gherkin contract farming yeah repeat ma'am no idea what role do agronomists play in the success of gherkin contract farming yeah agronomy is the main for the every each and every agriculture uh, operation uh, in agronomy practices we are doing uh, from plowing to uh, till um, end end of the crop we are guide the farmers for the uh, uh, weeding uh, spraying and uh, this one stacking everything uh, post harvest technology everything we are uh, uh, trained to the farmers and the uh, and the experienced farmers they, they know they are each and everything but the new farmer we have more uh, concentration on the so uh, because of the agronomy practice only we are getting more yield nowadays agronomy practice is improving um, this one um, replication is there um, this one um, uh we are not a solid fertilizer we are using because of that reason we are getting more yield uh, mulching mulching also using to improve the yield uh, compared to normal field mulching is getting more uh, double double the yield sometimes farm also getting surprised and uh, the price of uh, if you are doing mulching with uh, drip uh, the cost of uh, cultivation also uh, it's coming very less and no need for weeding and that because of the agriculture agronomy practice only uh, earlier uh, this this type of technology was not there now that uh, because of this, uh, this technology the farmers getting more profit and we are focusing on more on yield because of this practice only okay. how does contract farming impact the sustainability of gherkin production yeah because of the farmer uh, getting more profit uh, they uh, uh, they forward uh, coming coming forward to grow uh, gherkin and uh, each and uh, every farmer we only selecting so after selection only we are go for soy and, uh, and the control is there uh, in the companies only because the seeds are all, uh, not available in the open market what are the based on the requirement we are given the seeds to the farmers and on that basis only we are pro 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 uh, producing because of that reason over production less production problem will not be there okay. we are have a control uh, uh, through six so distribution you know how to count okay one two three four five six okay mr inba so before we end uh, i have one question last Perfect. question um, please yes, let sir. us know a little about it about your career background and what made you to take an interest in agriculture field yeah i have studied in uh, diploma in agriculture uh, in uh, gandhigram university in tamil nadu tamil nadu after that i joined a uh, field officer in a uh, private company up to state level i, I was involved then i uh, after uh, uh, 10 years i plan to do business because we want to support the farmers compared to uh, other companies we are supporting more the, to the farmers that reason i am starting this uh, company from 2011 Uh, we are very satisfying to the this to do this business now because the farmers are getting more benefit 
அது அதுக்கேவா எம்ப்ளாய்மெண்ட் ஆப்பர்ச்சுனிட்டி இன் தி வில்லேஜ் லெவல் இந்த வி ஆர் கிவன் மோர் ரெவன்யூ ஃபார் தி கவர்மெண்ட் டேக்ஸஸ் அண்ட் ஆல் ஐ ஹவ் தட் ரீசன் ஐ எம் வெரி ஹாப்பி டு டூ திஸ் பிஸ்னஸ் அந்த ஃபார்மர்ஸ் ஃபேமிலி வி ஆர் சப்போர்ட்டிங் லாட் வாட் ஆர் மணி தே தி நீர் வி ஆர் கிவன் சப்போர்ட்டிங் அண்ட் கெட்டிங் மோர் மோர் ப்ராஃபிட் தான் தென் தட் தட்ஸ் ஓன்லி வி ஆர் மூவிங் தான் Okay. Okay, Mr. Inbar. So now we have come to end of question round on uh, behalf of agricultureinformation.com. I'd like to thank you for the detailed uh, presentation and answering all the questions. And uh, I also like to thank the, uh, my editorial team for sharing the questions. The meeting will now be closed. Thank you. Okay, well, thank you so much. You're most welcome. Thank you. Thank you.